spring climbs the mountains. Hibernation isn't something an animal just wakes up from. Even after surviving here for seven months, if the transition from oblivion to action isn't exactly right, the marmot could die. It needs what's left of its fat stores to heat its heart and blood. The warmed heart beats faster. The warmed blood flows first to the critical areas. And then to the whole body. It's a quick system, but it takes almost all of what's left of the marmot's energy. If it takes more than what's left, the marmot never wakes up. Half the youngsters don't wake up. But most of the adults do, their bodies around a third lighter than when winter began. They're ravenously hungry, but they hardly eat for at least a week, the time it takes to rebuild their gut lining. And because they use so much energy just waking up, some don't last that week. Awake and amid the spring vegetation, they starve. Because there are so few Vancouver Island marmots, every survivor is important for the species. Understanding how hibernation works is important too. It may help save them. <laughs> 